Commander. What's your opinion of the last mission? Not sure I buy Dr. Tassoni's story about her and her mom not talking. They're family, right? I'm not sure I believe it either. It's better to have her where we can see her. That makes sense. Too bad those ruins got destroyed. I mean, they lasted thousands of years. That's impressive. Do you have a few minutes to talk? One on one? I'm off duty until tomorrow. I was gonna have a small drink. Bit of a celebration. If you're interested. What's the occasion? It's Armistice Day, when the first contact war ended. My family always marks it. Since I'm the only Williams aboard, I thought I'd ask you. You can't think I'm the most patriotic person on the ship. Nah, you just happened by at the right time. Don't tell me you don't know about my family. My commanders always find out. It's not in my files or something? Are you playing games with me? I don't always play games, sir. I'm General Williams' granddaughter, the commander of the Shanxi garrison in the war. The only human ever to surrender to an alien race. You're blacklisted because of your grandfather's cowardice. Cowardice. That's what the Terra Firma party calls it. I'm not gonna let our name go down with Arnold and Quisling. Granddad deserved better than that. What happened to your grandfather after the war? He was relieved of command as soon as Shanxi was liberated. They brought him back to Earth in irons, but there was never a trial. They quietly demoted him and stuck him behind a desk. He retired a year later and spent the rest of his life working construction in the colonies. Sometimes we hear about attempts to get him exonerated in some official way. Nothing ever comes of him. As I recall, your grandfather held out for a long time. The Turians wrecked the orbitals in the first wave and occupied the major cities. They sat in orbit, dropping rocks on anything that moved. Granddad dispersed the troops, but when they went into the cities for supplies, the Turians would wreck a block to eliminate one fire team. Civilians were dying, his troops were starving, and he couldn't contact Alliance High Command. So he surrendered the garrison. Sometimes you have to fight to the bitter end. You plan to bail if Saren gets the upper hand? No, sir. I'd die to stop him, if that's what it takes. Him and anyone else who tries to screw with the Alliance. So now you know. Gonna kick me off the ship, Skipper? You're tough and decisive. I value those qualities. Just consider me a fire-and-forget missile. But anyway, I've got things to do before we land. I'm sure you do too. Do you have a few minutes to talk? One on one? I should get back to my duty, Skipper. Rifles don't maintain themselves. Not yet, anyway. Dismissed, Chief. Ma'am. <laughs>